Hey, what's up, guys? So it's another video blog here. Um, if you haven't noticed, uh, last week was kind of a fluke being on Thursday, but I'm actually deciding that uh, doing two videos on Wednesday are kind of killing me trying to get time-wise uh, with different things going on. So I'm going to move video blogs from Wednesday to today, which is Thursday. So video blog to Thursday. Uh, let's play still Monday, Wednesday, and Friday because it's just it's the easiest that way. Um, streaming and all that stays the same. It's just the video blog thing kind of got. It just I try not to rush these and try to make them good. So after that, so video blogs Thursday now, Thursday, Thursday, Thursday. Okay, cool. So uh, what I want to talk about here is uh, the new like. Do you buy like the new Madden, the new NHL, the you know FIFA? PSE, do you buy the next copy? The, always the next copy every year. Uh, for me personally, I don't. Uh, I really don't see the need to do that. Uh, I don't. I guess I don't play hardcore Madden. I even, I, you know, I even play. I used to play college football hardcore, but I never bought the next one every year. You know, there's no real point to that. Uh, what I do is I usually play in dynasty mode and I keep you know adding to my dynasty and adding to my dynasty and adding to my dynasty you know and where I don't get why people keep buying the next one every year because there's really not much honestly changes in the games from year to year uh you know three four years there's you know subtle subtle differences where you know the AI is a little better there's a couple more plays and all that so that's that's the thing is I don't I don't get why people keep buying them every year because we and they go sell them you know, to games up. Oh, I traded it in. And it's like, how, how dumb are you? You know, I actually haven't. The last Madden game I actually bought. And this is the honest truth. Was uh, Madden 2007, uh, and John Madden was on the cover because he was in the Hall of Fame. And that's pretty much the only reason I bought it. Other than the football game, I think it was on sale at the time. I think it was like 20 bucks. But uh, that's pretty much why I got it, and I really never even played it that much. If you look at my uh, Xbox One has probably been, oh, almost eight years since I played that. Um, like I said, I, I love college football more, but you know, they discontinued that, and that's a whole other day, a whole other topic. Um, but, uh, you know, I don't, I guess people are like, oh, there's updated rosters on it. Well, you can really do that. Like in Madden, you could, you could create rookies, you could remove people. You know, that's, that's easy to do. I, I don't see, and, you know, they give you the numbers and, and so many websites for the, what the players are and changing, so you could, you could adapt those pretty quickly. So I guess I just don't see why people keep buying all these, you know, the new copy every year, where it's, you know, maybe, maybe if you didn't, if everyone didn't buy the new copy every year, then in next, you know, every, say, even year, you know, a new Madden comes out. Odd year, roster update comes out. Even year, new Madden comes out, roster update. Every other year, you know. But but people are so crazy, like, gotta have new Madden, gotta have new Madden, gotta have new NHL. Why? Why? Why do you need this? This is like my biggest soapbox, my serious biggest problem. Why do you people need the new Madden every year? Every year you waste... At 60 bucks on a game that really doesn't change just for roster updates. Do you see me, people? Roster updates. Why? Yeah. It just it boggles my mind that people haven't picked up on this. That there is no difference. Oh, they changed the menu up. Who gives a shit? Sorry, but who gives a shit? The menu changes. Who gives a shit? It's a roster update. There's no difference. There's no difference. Tell, you tell me the four things. Four things, and you can't say roster that were different from this year's version to last year's version. Four. Four. In the comments. In the comments below. Tell me four. Tell me that I'm wrong. Tell me there's four differences. Four differences. And if you say better AI, that doesn't count. That doesn't count either. Because, no, that's dumb. There's no difference. There's no difference in it. Four. You gotta give me four reasons I should buy 
the next Madden. I don't have Madden and Xbox One. There might be a reason to buy one, but if you buy it every year, every year you bought you bought twenty five last year, you bought sixteen this year. Tell me why I, you are buying six seventeen, and you gotta give me four reasons. Four. There are four reasons. It's not even like you look at older Madden's. You got my older Madden's. Here, I'm just gonna go on a little rant. You go on older games. I'll pull out. Oh, let's say Madden 07. Not even Madden 07, because that's not even that's not even old enough. You get older Maddens, they had historical teams. Historical teams. Like years and years of teams. They don't have that anymore. All they have are the generic teams. One year they had all the NFL Europe teams. Then they had an NFL Europe All Star team. Plus historical teams. And different jerseys. And you never get that. Never, never get it. Not anymore. I, I don't get what people like, oh my gosh, it's so great. Why? Why? EA used to try with these games. Would try. Would try to make them better. Try to make them different. Make it a little bit different. But that doesn't happen anymore. Do you people realize that there's nothing different except for the roster? Like I said, four reasons. And it doesn't have to be, it doesn't have to be men. If you play NHL, Give me four reasons. You play, uh, what's the Roy McIlwain PGA? Four reasons. The difference from Tiger Woods. Two K. Four reasons. You give me four reasons, and roster update cannot be in it, and advanced AI cannot be in it, because that's a bull on the advanced AI. Four reasons. Four reasons down there. If you dislike the video, don't like what I'm saying. That's fine. But once you dislike it, tell me your four reasons why you disliked it. Because I'm right? Because that's what I am. It's a roster update. If you guys like the video, please hit the subscribe button. That helps me appreciate you so much. Uh, I love you guys so much for it. After that, please check me out on Twitter. Please check me out on Instagram. Please check me out on Twitch when I broadcast and all that. And I love you guys for it. I will see you again for Thursday for another video blog, and also, like I said, Monday, Wednesday, and Friday for Let's Plays. And Monday is going to be kind of longer games. Wednesday is going to be short games. Friday is going to be series. So, it's going to be like multiple, multiple, you know, up to seven like they were for Seduce Me. And... Uh, SC2VN is probably going to be even longer. So I will see you guys. Bye bye.